still very laboured versus FPX. That's actually now, true, but can. I, I agree that with what Nino Zinio said. I think. Um, Alright, so Heretics on the fence, Genji on attack, and them. we have Rians doing the molly that's going to land exactly. on top of their heads yeah. in a lot of it. A a a so a that means we that Karen is super. Oh, a lot more okay. to be desired from Heretics. Yeah. Gonna make this right. I was looking at Woot just absolutely. Yeah, Karen super isolated. Control. It's taken down, and this was nice from Heretics. Reaction over towards. It's Benji Fishy, and it's Rians, but they've been pushed back by that orb. X is going to look to try and play through it. Always fearsome in these pistols. They're doubling up. They're expecting it. They're waiting for him, and that works out for them. No trades to be yeah, had. And they were waiting for a reaction on this. This is a good pistol, a good though. Start for him with the pistol Super aggro under over the towards A. We've got Molly that Last goes around, from B, so they can the have a faster side, rotate so a over towards C. They insta react over towards C because of the fast Molly. They've got a insta. Two people here ready for a push. It was great. And they did not let go of those reins once they got their hands on them. For now, well, it starts out as a they were expecting um. I think they were expecting well, two people nice there. Buy from I'd be surprised they know about, they they know about the molly though because they stole the molly after um, Correct me if I'm wrong as well, it was Madrid. both pistols in the last map. They do know that he could be there. They, they were um, dude, they want a pistol, man. Well, so like NG lost a pistol, 2-1. Similar philosophy, although Guardians versus Bulldogs. But obviously again, it means you can only really afford to lose one player. Mini Boo's going to try and get aggressive earn up as many orbs as he can towards those shows. But that, that's the thing, an incredibly close map, a, a map that I think that you look at for the side of Heretics and go, okay, they probably could have taken that without some of the crazy plays that we had from either side. But with a pistol or two they go under for their the belt, C, They go for the seawall. The problem about the seawall is, is a tougher map. so hard to a go back out map. towards pressure over towards A. To the side of Gen G. Already. This has been the sort yeah, of so as they tried to do it, Fadei goes out on a flash to make sure they're not through the one way. Initiator. They do block vision on this. Now he's playing that more aggressive war, which at times I don't necessarily mind. They have to Fadei back to quite double check that no one's behind Rubble. I, I guess did it as well as Boo did prior, but Boo did incredibly well on the fade, so it's kind of like a much of a muchness. Yeah, we definitely saw the Rubble control struggle, where when Boo is in play, that's sort of his staple, and the way he locks that down. Round after round, boot. Yeah, well, he's okay, they're down not going to get much in this round, but they got to they got to try go down. The they have 20 seconds. Yeah, All they got 20 the seconds. They're 20 just moving out left. over yeah, towards A now. Have no choice Who now, has a tether to stop them as well? Into the site. They got to run it down. Now, luckily, there is only one man actually within the site. If they can isolate that jewel, they'd have a chance. A and there goes the tether. That might stop them getting to site to plant. They got to die though. They don't even have time to actually plant this one. Yeah, Boo's not even facing them something this is very very peculiar and, and might absolutely destroy well yeah they didn't even pick up the weapon try their money because they got, they got they the plan. a little bit of extra damage and they're still going to be able to get in with the light shields but yeah definitely one where I, I think they let that clock go down just a little bit too low and because of that Wait, are if be you plan missing, after like the time you get full himself a, a boom bot because of that and can't buy up with the heavy shields either if you plan after the time it counts some of the guns oh, that are on okay. the other side is that could be a fairly big problem i think i did know this because someone told me last year as well but it definitely didn't process in my brain feel for how those rotations come into play but hey, well at that moment in time i definitely didn't know this for a little bit too long and then the clock became their biggest enemy we're gonna see a two to zero lead for Heretics. Rifles in. Benji Fishy down to eleven. That's HP told me to before. Yeah, I think he did tell Genji me before. Having that full buy. Do you know what I do with the mods, man? I the ignore them. Last time they broke about the what they told me. right off rip, and it was a one player rotation in, but not much contact Would make outside of sense. that. I think they're gonna try the same um, okay. here with the turret down, make noise on A, <laughs> and then go through Big that round. Oh, the timing of the fight. Here. Both players have the information, but. With control lost. Fighting for this one definitely has a gamble about it. It's seeming like they may end up just going for the retake here on the heretic side, but with the weaker weaponry, that's definitely not going to be easy. Yeah, this is Genji playing off the info they got in the last round. It may not have been an ideal conclusion, but in the early round, they at least felt it out in a way that gets the spike on the ground. 
Gets their opponents on the back the foot, like you said. Weaker weapons the reason the really take, the already are going to win this off the pawn is because they There's got no one so over towards uh, the they main bot. Nate, good for they can do a good amount of that damage here, Heretics. Rianz does well to trade out, but now the pressure's on because Meteor's hitting yeah, everything so again. Heretics, Rianz. I'm not super worried because it's a bonus, but future, this door's got to be pressured. Shout out to Meteor. The Meteor's having an absolute best of three here. And a round on the board for the attackers. Yeah, I think either we're going to have to start counting his 4Ks before he gets another ace just yeah. to see if he can actually catch up because he's already had a few in this series. Or we just have to combine the statistics and make one much bigger number which because ev everyone loves big numbers. Either way, it is going to be a buyback. A little bit of extra damage done. So it, it's Dang not yeah, necessarily he looks, uh, the end he looks of the world incredible, heretics, but with the blip that happened in round number two, maybe we would have hoped for a little bit more nonetheless. The only ultimate that's relatively close is Meteor. Miniboo's already dead. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, we talk about that Robo That was all was from him. For Team oh. oh my okay. god. On Lakia, and he's gone to another spam. That's an unlucky okay. start. Oh. But yeah, the, the Robo control has I guess he saw him Satchel before the smoke. And he spammed him. Still sitting towards Gen G, though. It's a big map. Those rotations, not as easy when you've only got four players. Yeah, they're taking their time. Boo, holding the tiniest of pixel angles. I can tell you for free that my eyesight isn't that good. I was going to say, I couldn't see anything there, but... He's able to thanks. see absolutely everything. Fallen back. Off of the nade. Paranoia through, but there really isn't much support. It's taken a long time. I don't think they believe this was the real push. It means that the IGL map angle. is having to try and Dude, hold the line on Odin there, and not it isn't going to go well. Benji re-ends. Gonna have to full retake this one. Benji actually going in a little bit early, and I think he's been spotted. He has, and you see the ping. Yeah, he down plays, from he plays exactly true stretch though, on. right? Boo. Steps out of the way. Oh, Maybe you Benji's can see it on that. He knows there could oh. be a player here. It's all down to timing. Which way is he gonna be looking when the swing comes through? Oh. And it's the right way. Two versus two. Kept competitive. Turret goes down for the info. Turret goes down indeed, right it's after. Still, still That's so, so hard to win this one. Decided to play the long game. Reposition up to heaven. Take it together. The steps will be heard now, though. And the headshot Ooh. angle from Karen. Perfect. Meteor. The man who's been finding 4Ks in so many rounds. He's only got one kill between him. And that lead taken out of Heretic's hands. That a fuse needed all the way. And really Meteor nicely sticking done, man. This guy by. looks great. Two to two. Now tying it up early on. Gen G won't let Heretics have much of a lead. No, and, and a safe pair of hands. And you can already tell with the way that this map plays out, you have high expectations. Yeah, back to back rounds, forcing down to an eco. Because you can very easily the uh, Killjoy or all. They got eco as well, so they could the maybe try and get Razor or Fatal online. So they, Next. even though there was a nade put through, there was smokes. There was um, if you're so Heretics right now, you probably go super aggro over towards eight, try to get mini boo orb. The two players on B and C didn't move, uh, so it came down to just okay, can boo. Do a lot of damage. The combo is oh. perfect, but it's yeah, the Claus first had to use a second, to uh, second just TP on this TP one. Out of there before the real damage. Who opens the whole TPs down? Already knocking on heaven's door. <laughs> the Prowler Poor guy, do, man. The texture did. Woot, the rest of his team don't really one, have the HP the or the needle. guns to help him out. He found out the hard way that he didn't. Like he said, mini boot. Two HP. The swing from Boo into heavy traffic, only spotted by the one player. Flank up by Rianz. If they can slow them down and send them in the other direction, Rianz could have some serious value to find, but it's being watched this whole time. Karen's been staring at it. And well, he got a good sight on that bullet coming straight for his head. Nice clean They're equalization, but they're pushing up and two HP. Mini Boo still gets one. He's made things a little bit more costly. We know what they can do with the sheriffs and they're probably a little bit wary of their flank at the moment. May want to try and take some extra ground away and boot. Well, he's got no choice but oh. to fall over. The utility is perfect. Pinged up, good, tagged up, caught in position, and it was all too easy. Balakia, now one man standing in the form of Rians. As I said, he had a quieter first map, but we know what this guy can do, especially if you give him fights. But look at the position of Texture. He's coming up behind him. I think this will be the freest kill ever. Meteor even very, very goes nice. for a swing just to make sure that if there was any contact, there was no way that his teammate doesn't get that kill few big rounds for Meteor, and we've got a lockdown online Dude, for Gen G. Um, take a look at Heretics. <laughs> Meteor's just the taken screen. over. Got a little bit to work with. A Viper's Pit, a Showstopper, a Nightfall. 
a lot on that defensive side to react around and potentially turn and tip the scales in their favor. But everybody on Gen G who hasn't got an ult is just one away. Yeah. This is going to be a chaotic round or two ahead of us. And whoever comes ahead in these may well have the wind in their sails. Yeah, Thank God they won a pistol because without the pistol, it's been a crack their fingers, wipe the sweat crazy off their one sided. Brow, get ready for all of those ults being put into play at once. But yeah, I, I don't mind the early pulls from Heretics because, uh, again, they, they've had a couple of opportunities here and there. But the second you allow Gen Meteor, G to start uh, he was incredible at Shanghai like as well. Yeah, Meteor just performing to that high standard. He Do it. He's doing the, the Yoru, but it, it really does just doing the Karen man the where he just. I, dude, I feel like all the Gen G have this, a lot of value, you look where a lot of maps and they just have like an Gen extra G, gear for just the big, big tournaments. It's so scary. A lot scary. of teams, I think Breeze in the past was their sort of exception to that. But it's just because they play off of everything so well. They have so much depth in individual skill, but also in their synergy. And even just look at some of the late round utility. This is why I love players like Lackier that, again, I, I think was overlooked for quite a while getting back into the tier one. It's just how solid all of that utility is that the fights that he takes... It's yeah, definitely worth a timeout on this one. There's the a lot of things to dead. talk about, whether it's That's orbs, whether it's well. ults. You mentioned in the last one about Meteor on the Duelist, and you're talking here about his versatility. The, the guy's currently got more kills than the rest of the team added the together. Hard one. And Texture, slow to that start. Last long. <laughs> yeah, Genji win like champs, would you say they're the best team of all time? Yeah, and I would have no doubt. And it will be the show thing it as well. Like we said, everybody yeah, on that Phil, attacking side I would be 100% confident. One away. And yeah. so fighting for the orb early often makes sense. Texture's trying to get the orb. What, what the they've done this year, Doesn't even if they get to the final, the straight up. Goes to in the even end. if they Viper's get to the final, I'm still saying it. Um, I feel like that was almost a common. What they've done this year is insane. He's like, no, I'll get my own orb. No worries. Think you can stop me, but not the case. Boo's about to come under some pressure. You know what's most? Do you know what's most He's insane about it as well? They're everything but the box. Bit of a meta change. Paranoia. Change some agents, up, buff some duelists, change some maps out, and still do it. That's it. That's crazy. Fnatic clears. Fnatic had like the same meta the whole time. I'm pretty sure. Now, the defense themselves have a lot of ultimates. Nightfall, Being able to adapt to that is uh, incredible. Could be in play, also, the fact, level of play is way better this year than it was. In case the team's understanding of Valorant is just way, way better. The average team in Valorant. Is it's so much better than last year. The showstopper through with an Odin and a Viper's pit activated at an inopportune yeah, time. Yeah, I mean, just Rien's the ult down over towards sight. So and now it's all left onto a man <laughs> decaying inside a pit. Just like the chances of heretics in this series as round after round goes to Gen G. Four to two in the lead now. That's four in a row. And a little yeah, bit of deja vu for the heretics squad as the streak continues. They used a lot of ults so into this. I, again, look at how many ultimates have just been used. Yeah, everyone had a good understanding that it was just such just a... to try and get this round into competition. Such I, an I important round, I don't mind round, the showstopper but... being used just to try and catch the Viper, like exiting. You're going to fall back immediately just to try and get the integrity of the pit and make sure they have to run through it, but it doesn't connect, and then it's just all falling apart again. Not again. We've seen this fight so many times, but every time there just seems to be a oh, response. Oh, nice he just spammed him straight through those six. Making this one competitive. Caron, we know the performance yeah, of this TP guy out of there as well. From Meteor, they know... Plenty of weaponry to choose from, and on the other side, they haven't found anything yet. Just those pistols, and that's going to oh, be there. Oh, it's such a shame, man. He wanted to try Horses trade him. Shout out to Meteor once again. again finding these kills. Literally... Pulling put all of the contention. rounds they won on his back, maybe. Getting themselves a plant alongside it. Benji now up against two with a marshal on the retake. Really not the weapon that you want for this. And they're both focused on the head. 12 to play. 3, yeah, he's the incredible. Bot covering the walk down below, there is no element of surprise to be found for Benji Fishy. The turret now watches the angle they expect him to come from, and Meteor is going to swing on that turret's contact. Benji retrieving a rifle seems to be the best oh, option for him. He has a choice to save it or to commit. <laughs> There's a nano perfect. waiting for him on the door. He's going to lose a lot of his HP and still has to take down two <laughs> players in a timely fashion. The turret now looking to do its own damage and get his own little assist in. Eight bullets. Oh, my goodness. Well, yeah, shout out to Meteor once shot. again. How many sure, times we send this guy's name? 21 HP, but Gen G are on five rounds. Uh, it's just a discipline. I, it, just to hold, even when you've lost a few players, like nobody overextending of the remaining two. 
and then just the way they played that post bomb, they, they knew that they were ready with that advantage, didn't need to give Benji Fishy anything. If he has a sheriff, we already know that he could have turned the round on his head, but just nobody faces him. Nobody yeah. gives him an angle that he can fight, had the turret for contact, the smoke, so he had to run through it, doesn't know what's on the other side, and then even had the nanos ready in case he tried to run through either angle. It was a perfect post bomb that gave him no opportunity. Now though, Odin bought into play. Information gone and Showstopper used as well. Well, they know exactly where that Odin is, okay. but they won't be able to rule yeah, out the position. Yeah, not the most well impressive uh, uh, spacing for this one. Definitely nice Utah from Heretics four. to isolate. Who's done a little bit of damage, tickled up some Raid of boss is alive, though. Sneaking Raid boss has right somehow through. made it into the corner. Wait, it looks like Durham. He has yeah. an idea, and he strikes just in time, just before Lakia was ready to a swing Raid the boss down, 4v3. Yeah, also, Lakia just had a little bit of hesitation. This should be it. This should be the round. Mini Boo push behind, no map control. He's going to wait for his team. Mini boo as well, this aggression. Yeah, if you look into the round right now, you probably give Genji like what, fifteen percent chance to win. Get this flank. It's not expected at all. Munchkin walking backwards into the angle, but Mini Boo's looking for a little bit more. Still only going to be the one. But with the lockdown in play, they're both going to have to be forced completely out of the sight. Lackier is the only one that can really hope to try and do any damage on the way in, and the counter spam is better. Yeah, Karen, one versus three, and the spike already being defused. Catches one on the side angle, but needs to get yeah. on that defuser Very nice immediately. Done. And Rianz buys enough time. If you're Gen G, you're actually three feeling all right. And at least we won't three people see die and then have to rebuy. What happened last time? So that you can reset them after this round. Five here and now. And look, Gen G, they're not in a super healthy economic position. A lot of the time, you'll see five rounds in a row, and a team can buy two or three yeah. times in a row. But Remember how many players they lost in just the last, and there's been damage across the board in most rounds. The good stat from Saint for the people that are uh, the damage is definitely gonna on the edge of working out if we're uh, trying to say that they're going to be the best team this year if they do sides, like reach like the, the final. Uh, Genji have played well. nine maps this year and a total of 107 he times. Fnatic last year played seven maps, a total of 66 times. That's all that we need stat-wise. Part of the game plan. Well, I thought for a moment right. Munchkin was going to find that Reigns, though. Clearly, feeling confident in that fight, knowing there was spam going elsewhere, just went running up and gets the opener for his team. Five versus. Did even just the nine maps is no shields on the site. But he's got Wu with him to help him out in these duels. Doors been opened and closed a number of times. It just keeps spinning around. See if heretics get out of their way on the B site. There's still two stacks. Ooh, that's an overstep on this okay. one. Yeah, dude, Boo so is in for Gorgeous the pixel stuff. angles at the Four moment. And there you go. Meteor, he is he in the for the pixel angle. Pixel angle over play. towards A. Pixel angle over Five towards to heaven. They found their footing. A decent couple out of here rounds, using that. that economy now Odin. starts to become a bit of an issue. I think they might still be able to scrape a buy with some low shields or maybe just even juggling rifles around maybe there'll be one player here or there that isn't going to be able to get a gun the question though will be did genji want to gamble it all here and, and honestly with the ultimates that they have online i, I think the answer should be yes you're one one away from a lockdown nightfall available okay the other two are a little bit further away but these are alts that can definitely pad the gap the thing is though heretics aren't just going to sit back in fact i was about to say minibus doing the opposite he went running initially but after not seeing anything, they're going to fall back to try and stack up some and two in a row, they forcing down to eco. Oh. If they've gone light, they've gone for SMG. This might be the spot they hit. Did you even consider adding a bit more to that defense? They dodged the turret to start with, trying to creep their way around mound. There's no way to cross that, but maybe we'll see. You know, I was thinking we'd see a smoke go down. The idea, perhaps, being that they'd be wide enough by the time the turret sees any of those players that someone would swing out just to check. Is it one guy far away? Is it, and bang, yeah. you take his head clean off. Genji, they'll go back in the other direction now, and they have successfully dragged rotations. Nice Seasight now double stacked up like we Big saw question before. mark, instant. A little bit weaker, but you've still Instant got Boo pivot on the over towards still A. Has his ultimate to work no with info too. here, and they don't want to go to A so they know they can get close. A significant close. amount of time, but it also allows him space to fall got back a good amount of time. if needs be. And I think it I, might I mean, be. I looking at this minimap wise, I feel like they can use Fadal. Yeah, they do use Fadal. No. Does he use Fadal back? Yes, he does. One, two, three, four. Doesn't get the Viper extent. Aggressive push coming out from Texture. He might not be able to hear, but he's hoping the same's on the other side. The reveal is perfect. Coming out from Lakia, but even still, it's only going to be the one. But with the plant in, 
They're gonna use the lockdown. This will buy them even more time. And flash misses. JG have a foothold. Karen fallen below, but he'd been spotted. The swing in from Rehan's not good for anything. The guys are just gonna tank the ult. Meteor is there to back him up, recover the Dude, rifle even as in well. the low Give buy, the fighting chance up they realize Genji. map control wise, the one versus two they last can time. fade ult to take sight. And, 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 and he may Joy just see the same again. With the again in the after plant, so even with the worst the guns, they're gonna win. That's pretty insane. Another round for Genji. Like the ult the here were not bad at all. Building up quite a lead. And let's not forget their defense was sublime last time they faced. Yeah, I, I love the way that they combine ultimates together. Like they basically force heretics. And, to and one of the reasons they can do this is because of Meteor surviving as well. Like because he go, he pops his ult and then he has Molly for after part. And they just know so time wise that so they don't even need to win do, many duels to do this. It's just a more aggressive take. And when you have this is a pure time play of dispositions that they have. What you want. You don't want to allow them that time to use the utility. Genji, it looks like they're going to battle for this position again. We've seen the same attempt at seize nades before, but not this time. Wall drop to see Texture attempt this fight onto Woot. The problem is the swing up close that could come in. Boo is just tucked, and Mini Boo's backing up the fight inside the it's door. This combo. Absolutely perfect. Yeah, he has to push forward, otherwise he's going to die from time. the util. trying to take a fight and at least make his <laughs> Actually gets worth three, it man. He well, killed this guy in the, the corner and then activated. goes back to kill the other guy. That's already under wild. his belt. Perhaps it could be the ace, but Meteor is waiting to try and deny that. Benji yeah, we're gonna Fishy gonna... facing the glowing gun. The spray is good. He's down to just one. His potential Plant for an ace. The site. In a while At for least him. I think so. There we go. And Karen has lots of teammates rotating. Like Problem is, uh, oh, Heretics wait, are going to want to save at one point. He's 20 HP. And no one else was on that side. Instead, looking like it might just have to be a save. The economy for Heretics is in the bin and after they finally get so clean yeah they've done their homework the as well once more, it, it seems like more of the same you can tell as soon Whatever as they take map control take over towards Again, here they to don't the get like the seas, too much resistance they see the door it, down like they know this guy is here and they're, they're ready they're calling ready to just evanade or they've even seen him it's just like you're gonna force players into an angle that texture's holding you're dead you have to hit some crazy shots and Unfortunately, this time it wasn't to be. But I, I just feel like his utility is nigh on perfect. Like, it, it really is hard to give too much criticism. And it's one of those things where you look at the depth of this team. Not you want to try to get one for your ult here? He has no money if he dies, right? Meteor and I think you have to prioritize your like guns over. The next hour and just talk about how many kills those guys are going to get. But the supportive element of utility that comes alongside it. It just makes it so Amber. difficult for teams to actually have a fair fight versus those players. Well, that's exactly it, Tom. You know, the, they are deadly weapons, and their teammates are very good at pointing them in the right direction, finding exactly where the targets are, the spotters to the snipers. 7-4, to four. Gen G with a big lead, an expected strong half coming up for them, and Team Heretics... They can't be feeling too great about their chances here. Showstopper activated and fired through just for the space. It's crowd control. Door opens. Mini Poo meets a bullet to the head from Meteor. But the trade is there. Keeping it okay. alive with Benji Fishy. So catching good. the aggression from All right. Texture. Genji don't have any advanced control. Uh, Genji have the most important bit of map control. He's got himself a nasty I would angle. love to he is isolated. wait for Rian's because he kind of wants to clear this oh. and open this. Last time he attempted these spams, uh, this is doable for Genji, man. May just have himself yeah, this is really here. doable. The spacing, perfect. The seeds has caught them again. He has a, they, he they has a smoke move. to play They're behind all in that as well. Back corner. And instead, just playing off angles. Karen with another, just dancing around. Damn, dude. <laughs> <and every laughs> They're too good, man. We haven't had to talk too They're much actually about too good. Look at how they play so some of these situations. Because of the presence of other players, but when he's needed. That's exactly where he arrives. Boo, he doesn't even have the time to get anything done That's here. Eventually, Lackey is so there well while both players will go down. But why uh, Shower Natty, thank, thank you so much, round. man. Appreciate the gifted. Thank you, thank you. 46 all together, one right now. Thank kills. you for that, sure. man. He's 8 and 9. Might not be the easiest one to hail. The scoreboard, Stevens. Obviously, I'm, I'm pretty much everyone looks at Meteor. But this whole team has so much depth. An unbelievable this is the thing with Karen at the moment, Heretics especially with these two maps. It's like, never two. had to do too much flashy stuff. This is like the flashes he's had to do. But it's just so, just so reliable, so much impact. And they're all perfect. Trade in any phone in any condition, guaranteed. And get $800 off the new Galaxy Z Fold 6. Only on Verizon.
Ambino, good morning. Have you missed anything good? Bro, you gotta watch that Abyss font. Red you have to wins. watch that Abyss font. It, it's the best Abyss we've seen by... by quite a bit. Like, bo both the teams play, like, really sick on Abyss. It, it wasn't even like Gen.G had, like, the best Abyss I've ever seen, because honestly, Heretics is, this is, like, insanely good. It's just, it was just a stacked... It was just a stacked VOD, man. Wait, <laughs> who's Brid Production? Production, EMEA bias, man. What's going on here? Prius again, yeah, he's at it, man. Third map. I mean, Heretic's got to win a pistol. Pistol, fast buy kind of vibe. Bonus. Team gotta get the, gotta get the double pistol. Moving into a half where last time I believe they Laz got has more viewers than FNS, bro. Laz is, Laz is giant, though. For a two -zero, Tom. I feel like Laz I mean, would pretty much always have that. that needs to Laz is insanely the popular in Japan. Come back into this, and I think the main thing is much like the dinosaurs, they need to dodge that meteor. I, have, I think they have so many more problems than just him. But Laz I is the face agree. of it, uh, Japanese banner, yeah. Them going into the second half, and I, a pistol is and it's, uh, it's popular to watch out there. And other than Crazy that, popular to watch. Round, Tony managed to win a couple. The sheer force that Gen G are coming in with. And they're looking like a shoo-in for the playoffs already. Nobody surprised by that, but... Um, so pistol-wise, it's a 2-1. Two two and this needs to be... Oh, obviously 1-0 on this map. And I'll be honest, but this needs right to be now, two for Heretics, yeah. Fairly easy. Munchkin, oh, it's, it, it's almost identical to the last map. Just ready with a snake bite. Going to do some damage as they run in, but not anything too deadly. They're looking yet. good at the moment. Plants in. we got Plants the Lark over towards Team Heretics. Heretics. Most important yeah, map control. Gen going for these groups. The pistols, so... It's actually the and still do it, but... Success. The moment, the you would say the Heretics the are okay. Able to land it to start with, and Gen G... They get absolutely the annihilated on site. Shout out to the jump. Like, it's so hard to trade the these people when they're doing this. The swing good to start with. They think that could still this be is the best bit of map control, though. Take the fights. Why it's important now, yeah. both players have been spotted. Both players have been tagged down low as well. Gen G on the back foot out of Good nowhere job, with Texture stepping up in the headshot for Boo. Low HP on both. It's just a few. Damn, more. very <laughs> nicely done from Wu. Very nicely Bull done. All right, 2-0 on the pistols. The, the important map control so came out on top here. Balling. Shout out to the... I, I mean, shout out to... Is it 2v4 with 2-4? 4 on site 2 here. Again, uh, you're kind of seeing why it's the most important map control there. I think that maybe Genji could have stuck or pressured the spike a bit better. That first half ended in a fashion of... I think when that smoke is up here, they probably got a... This is the guy that... When it came down to Shanghai was a... Unbelievable performer, put himself on the map. Bear in mind, when we started off this year, Woot wasn't even. Uh, it's still impressive from Genji how they actually managed to get like, over I towards site. Like to everyone jumping out to make sure that people can trade there was great. Well, no some doubt. of the HPs of the yeah, jewels felt like 34, 20 something. Uh, 2 2 Come for pistols. Here. 2 0 on both maps. Again, why? Yeah. You They're allowed a death on attack. Squad, but I, I think that it's been proven time and time again that. Genji, once they get into those buy rounds, once they have the utility to play with, are fierce. And they've even put a little bit extra into this round. Obviously, having the plant and the cleanup of players. I'm scared of that, Marshall. I'm kind of hoping for Heretic's sake they don't go that way. Well, they did smoke him off to start the round, and now his turret's being destroyed as well. So, limited opportunity so far for Meteor to land a shot. But now, one is presenting itself. Benji's only got the ghost, so he's happy to take some risks. <laughs> Honestly, lucky. <laughs> right, I saw his camera. I think yeah, he, like, looks, okay, he looks. He looks so shocked, man. It's like he's been the horror game again. Looking at the, the mini map or something. Oh, the shot just about evaded by Benji Fishy, and he's on his way to the A site, which is now mostly open. Just one player, just a classic. They've not seen him to start with, and well, lucky he only gets the one. A better weapon there, and that could have been a disaster. Ah, lucky, of course, is invested into utility, but it seems like he's going to wait. 
the teammates to round that corner. Still a couple of sheriffs to play with. This time, I think for the first time, the Seize is actually going to go and miss for that defensive side, but it's already the read. The Sheriff finds one. Gun picked up again. Even just making this costly Lucky could gets be huge, a gun. they found a Guardian now. Time a ticking! Whoa! Whoa! Well. How's Munchkin done Last that? Out, <laughs> yeah, shout out to Lucky for getting the, the last kill at the end here. Stopped. How have, <laughs> how have they done that? Gonna need that one slowed down a little bit, I believe. Yeah, you gotta see that double lot. sheriff kill. That's <laughs> unbelievable. Let's go. For this man to come in like that, swinging wide, pistol in hand. Look at him go. Okay. <laughs> it's gotta be infuriating. He only just, I think Luke was crouched and he just stood up. He literally just stood up and got insta double collided. What? It's a great time for texture, but it's got to yeah, be Yeah, and the one depth that they were allowed can obviously heritage. buy a They're rifle on top of this, rifle, and the double pistol doesn't matter so much that when you lose the next round. Extra one away from his ult. So for the next big buy round that is after this, they're going to have Razor online. Ilzinho talked at halftime about coming back to form. Well, that is, is quite a journey for this squad now. Lakia manages to find himself the correction and has support from Texture. Blast Pack goes in. Too little too late. No, <laughs> no, not too little too late. In fact, it was the sick. Seas, it, it, it was on the floor and now the wall did the damage and then there was just a seize there. A bit whiffy. A chance for Team Heretics to fight right back into things. Boo, he's gotten very close and a swing definitely caught Meteor off guard, but he corrects in time and the rotate that had come in off of that space now will meet a very well-defended C site. Still the turret watching the cross, although it will be smoked off. Now he'll have to play that contact himself. I don't think he'll mind. It is Meteor after all. Just waits for the poison orb to go up and then can watch, even making sure that he doesn't overextend. Yeah, still calm of it though. Right? We'll still calm of it. <laughs> what was that you said about not overextending? <laughs> not done. super calm, <laughs> but <laughs> maybe like uh, Took some a lot less calm than I thought. Well. But and although it's a little bit of extra damage, it's not going to do anything. And they get really textures off for uh, of them managing to this round, though. That second round, ten to five, double the opponent's score, and a response. Even I, I think just for it to get to a point of confidence, right, where you can actually feel like there's a possibility. I want to see Heretics get on this board a lot earlier. I, I don't think they necessarily have a, a similar mental strength to what a nightmare. some of the other teams in this tournament to come back. Uh, I like this from Gen G though. They go super aggro with the Razor. Some of the Paper used to do a lot. Also, they're one away from the Killjoy ult, so they're trying to just make sure that they can't get this orb, and they literally just go there and they pick it up from Lackier as well. So, yeah. instant reaction. Killjoy yeah. should definitely be picking up this orb right now. And Benji should definitely try to get this. Texture is the one finding the kill. Benji Fishy down and out of the round. The Wait, this no is such a there. good round for now when they they're. Just the side. Okay. A little whiffy from That's Meteor. a good round, a man. I can't even get over some of the stuff they're doing. Paranoia and landing a headshot, but 10 HP is enough for Woot to stay alive, to look for some headshot angles and to still participate. His smoke up the one way already surpassed, though. Lakia has dropped down below and he's got support That's up top, but up goes Woot. The 10 yeah. health man still done, getting man. the damage done. They're both quite low. And a man like Texture, keen to convert the first shots, don't land, but... Okay, nicely done from Rian. Shout out to Woot on this. Woot was everything here. Dude, this whole plan from Gen G was really nice, though. I know they lost the round, but, like, three-person push over towards C to make sure they can't pick up their orb, and then they pick it up, and then obviously have Razor, so they can do, like, what Paper X used to do with their ult. And then, at the same time on A or B, they've already broken this wall, so they don't feel super confident about picking up the orb itself anyway. That buys you enough time for them to to like not the convincingly opponent. take the orb for the killjoy the then go over towards a, a like even though they lost this round their the board, whole overall understanding of it is about pretty much the best Somehow, it can be at least in the last map where things got a little oh bit my tight, God, on his head. The that <laughs> dude the uh, uh the them. omens are getting wrecked out towards a at the moment they really are they had to do it themselves yeah and that's a gun down right yeah I think they're familiar with the, the flow Where of that. Where would you go, Karen? Oh, yeah, that yeah, is a gun down. I'll go hold it. Genji. And a floor, floor in a smoke, so you can get it, right? Smokes up as well, trying to steal back that weapon. It's not for free, though. If anything, that smoke gives them the advantage. Or just delay Inside time the whole time? And down, they're happy just holding them here? Stays close. Look down at Karen. Oh, no. no paranoia anymore. 
won't be able to fight for that all too convincingly. I, I wonder if Heretics used a lockdown here. You got a couple of other ultimates that are getting very close. Oh my! Spamming down to 17. To without too many risks, they've done okay. a lot of damage to Meteor, but obviously that damage is unconfirmed. And I think now, yeah, especially after spotting the rifle on Texture, force him out of position. Meteor's going to try and play the time. Sit in this corner until the very last second, until he has time to strike. He was low, probably would have gone down anyway. But that's going to even things back up, and Womp, Texture had to wait. 30 seconds left. Nate is decent. Texture was going down one way or another. Nice Go. shot by Munchkin. Another low HP challenger oh. steps up. Shot as well, to be honest. Now down to a sliver. Oh, they put a Fado the into this. A chance. For Gen G oh, until that life is goes up. Now, fade all in the reply of a viper. Just on one HP. The swing around from Lakia trying to catch this player. The spray is oh, good. Boy. Karen finds him. And now both players back on main face. What is the timing gonna be rifles. like of this? Karen getting most of his health back and then they got a fade eye as well still. Make sure that he's not quite so healthy. App, the spams fade eye. Cool. Lakia suspects that one player will push up close, but it's only to land the nano. And it is activated in time. The defuse denied a little bit longer. Now they have to force the issue and take the fight. They know exactly where Boo is. He has to hold on for survival. Oh, what a and shot, a man. Bang headshot. That's what, <laughs> what a shot. The line. Heretics were under sick. pressure. But the reaction is perfect. Yeah, I think, again, I think Genji there may be in the two on two. Could have had a bit of a better plan. Like a more convincing plan. Like a, I, I would like to have seen, like, well. tap of the spike there. Smoke on it so they don't the know. Drop down, fade, eye, double like, swing. Just because they've got so much time. It was just such a risk to try and get that into Especially when it's a plant in this good. You're going to end up swinging this anyway. A, a maestro of his we're, we're seeing some like the plans from Genji maybe not be 100% the best, but kill, the only thing that you can say really about what's going on. That. And he finds it. It's how annoying Boo and Eco. Uh, they used uh, Fado into Eco, though, so Heretic should be pretty happy with this one. And this was the old round that they did with the Razor earlier. A shrouded step to get out yeah, of there. Smoke, Satchel, the trying to get the. His full control Orp. over mound was taken by that defensive side. Now they start the rotation. Right combo as well with the fade eye through the smoke. Karen to keep that position. While well, the rest of the squad looks to reinforce the A site. You can see that Texture's almost in position. And Heretics may just play into their waiting arms. Okay. What a kill. Benji expects Lackier to be holding the angle. Of course, he did push it just moments ago. Yeah, swapping it up so Mini Boo can send it. Be away so that you can have that entry taken and the utility to force nice, so back. Prowler, so you know Players where you throw the Omen Flash, Tether, to make sure that no one floods out so you can cross and get the best plant, holding the best bit of map control. Meteor is also just one kill away from a lockdown, so anything he can find just by spams or pre-fires could give them away. The only way they lose really is if Meteor gets a kill. He's going to have to play through that, but well, there might not be much left for him to do. It's being cleaned up on the site. Yeah, this is nice very nice. Uh, you might see a Gen G timeout here. 10 to 8. The gap down to 2. Already a better second half than what we saw from the last time these two teams faced. The attack side of Heretic seems to have some legs to it now. Yeah, no, they're, they're looking good by their initial execution. They knew that Lackier had pushed already because he went and destroyed the turret, so they were very methodical with that initial Whoa. fight. And then just the utility they, they had <laughs> from afar with the. Hey, the look at some of the stuff Boo's doing sure in this. Nobody. Boo's crazy. Him from that heaven angle and caused them any issues. Then it's just those post plants, and, and that's where you do have high expectations, especially when you have the man advantage. You have everybody on the team at least performing to a decent level. And because of that, Genji are going to take themselves a pause. Now, the expectation will be that it's not going to be this round <laughs> that will end up being the one that this pause is for, is they're only going to have pistols, their economy definitely in a worse position. But they do have so much in terms of their ultimates. I have in the Vikings. Oh, yeah, but I mean, he's doing so good. Down if they need it, and one away from a showstopper. There's still potential in a lot of these rounds. And, and Ooh, in a good already, spot, though. Genji have been able to do so much with so hmm, little. I don't know where their money's the sitting. I think they're low buying. Make sure that they're very careful in these sort of rounds. Well, I look towards someone like Meteor or Tom. It's been a couple. I was sent to to win against that. Well, off. it should yeah, be focusing down. on FPX One first. Because <clears> that's not going to be an easy game at all. It's when I look at the player camp when he's getting shut down. You can see it's starting to affect him. He's starting to get in his head a little bit, perhaps. And you want to see him 
light back up that scoreboard. This might not uh, be Edwin, for it, Edwin underscore T C G with the prime. Thank Jeff you so much, man. Appreciate you. Stinger, all that they're working with. After that pause, we'll see what their ideas are. Pushing up on mound hasn't been easy. And Taking the control Garvey. has, but going any further, Boo seems to be there until the last couple seconds. Yeah, last minute purchase. I think maybe an attempt. I was going to say at some wall bags, but it doesn't seem I like it. As Munchkin's playing elsewhere, it's going to leave him with problems on the economy again. Okay. Again, again. Same Wolf thing, yeah. Caught it's literally the, uh, the antique around once again. We've seen before. The spams are going to do so okay. much with the okay. so the <laughs> It just okay. seems like the second these rounds get into weak well. economy, Gen G just find miracles. They have a two man advantage. <laughs> That's pretty sick. Wall, yeah, and really it's now a doable nice round. It's a great Amy shot from him. So they get the all out, and it's now well. a three v four. The life traded out for a bit of damage with him on fifty HP, oh, but he has a showstopper of his own. Gen G still have one towards this seaside. Dude, what a stacked York round this is! It's ridiculous. The shot, not gonna land. Just with the sheriff, has to be precise on these peaks, and it's Rians to shut him down. Seaside control now there for heretics. Yeah, it's patience that ends up getting Dude, that the kill. um th this Advanced could be another round up, that if heretics do win they, the weaponry in play, they'll take it right, we've actually had like the back-to-back -back ecos that kind of went similar with Wu going down um this one was fatal and, and, and this one was razor in fact showstop so. are going to be utilized but it's more just to try and hold them back the snake bite has delayed at least a little bit more they are locked in though but this old like position wise, you would say Genji win this. Miniboo, not paying attention, not ready for the players behind. Luckily, Benji has found another. Still decent weaponry now in play. With only pistols starting off this round, there's real potential for them to turn this back. Munchkin, his gun was never spotted, but he can't. Shout out land to Benji, man. Benji that one got close, though. Will be the last but I'm telling you, the they they'll take this. They got the uh, they got the razor out of them. Just one away. Oh, a big round from Benji indeed. Well, that was and a scary cool. round, man. Uh, Mini Boo hit a really nice shot on him, man. Dude, I kind of want to see the Sheriff shot as well. Beautiful timing by Munchkin as well. He really waited in that corner. All right, until the out of all the replays, we get that one. Watching it the whole time, he steps out, he dies. <laughs> That's a crazy decision. Himself a kill, but it's not quite enough. And, and the Odin flank from Lackey, not bad. A crazy, crazy decision. Take my hat off to it, but the lead still sits with Genji. One round ahead as Team Heretics look again towards Mound for the early control, and that smoke seems to be getting them everything they could possibly want. Again, this is where the majority of alts sit with Genji. Even though Heretics are bringing this close, they might be able to use that just to springboard themselves back into the game. We saw them close out the previous map in close fashion. They know that they can... Seemingly turn it back on whenever they need it. For now, Heretic's going to play things incredibly slow. They've got the Nightfall, so they can go for these sort of late round hits if need be. And, and I mean, like this is going to land on uh, Karen's head. Has a shrouded step and an ult to get out of here if need. Right. Oh, okay. Oh, really? Thing is, I don't even know if it's meant to go there or if it's meant to go on top of uh, it's doing some damage as rubble. At least able to find himself a way out with the shrouded step, but there's no pressure from heretics. They're moving in the other direction. They're moving Fade into all, the yeah, pit. You've this is least, a big risk. You use this into it. You've well. at least got to open they also that door. Prowlers, so it, it, this really is a gamble to try and force this man yeah, out. You got to open the door here. We've got 20 they seconds. They got to force to go through into a kill joe and a viper. What did you do? The snake bite to slow them even further. Yeah, okay, well, that's the done round. This couldn't any better by Genji if they tried. And now with 10 seconds left, Miniboo is going to have to fight tooth and nail. Needs to get this plant. Tries to bait in his opponent. Wins the fight. Oh, but I don't think he's got it. Oh, he I don't messed think that's going to be close enough. It's going to run out at oh, the last second. Oh, he messed up. Nice Dude, he got the impossible the shot, but then didn't but plant in time. Was played oh, he had Genji. time. It absolutely was. There is a split second where you see Munchkin thinking about going back into the pit. And that's when Meteor... Ah, he whiffed, he whiffed no, 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 on the plant. The fight. He and hit the hard shot, but whiffed on the plant. Yeah. Easy as can be. Well, he, put a, he put a snake bite in there as well, so yep. they were vulnerable. Like, every single combination, it was either you try and run back, wow. and you're going to end up going into the lockdown, so you can't go that way. You run forward, you're running into two players. Like, it, it is just... They have basically herded them like sheep. Yeah, they, they realized that. They have been culled. It was just...
wonderful usage of the ultimate. Devastating. But they did use a Still lot. impressive they got the they shot, did. but they that did. is devastating. They did in the early round before that, when the nightfall goes through, Lakia, 10 seconds before it started to rotate, and I don't know if it was Oh, that would have been a crazy round to have... Team, that actually might decide the half. He kept spamming. It would have been... Um, them with the damage. The one way went. I think... It would have been Kyojo or Vipro. They would have won against. Karen stand there solo, and then they realized, no, if we can stall That was slightly, the round, yeah, I think so. Maybe they go back the other right. direction. And if not, eh, we, uh, we shrouded step across, play at the broken door and play the retake. Still really doable for reset. From Gen G. They've had a number That's like the only like the only good news is like he got that extra kill, the so the reset on the rounds. Ahead. Two round gap now with two Money wise it's doable. To lock in playoffs. It's gotta be frustrating as well. Right, Mini Boo being able to find those two kills right towards the, the end, go, man. managed to play spoiler for what was a great round. Just I I think unable to quite plant within the last second i think even just a tiny tiny bit of hesitation which it seems like sometimes it. that's all it takes it's, it's brutal to talk about but i, I think it was genuinely like um, maybe hard yeah because look at this like there. this would be straight was, up reset one nine loss bonus felt, which would yeah, get it to 11 11. confidence but it definitely looked to me so, like, like damage done there plant after the kill like uh, the it's it's devastating the misclick Oh and boy, so, oh, the plant, the but... This is a risky play from Munchkin. Yeah, they're on top of this with the low money as well. Maybe this is the most common time. spot they like to use for the judge. The it like they were very on top of that. Pick. That's already going to force issues for the rest of the team. Because you have your plan with deep B control in mind. It's a risky TP. I guess didn't spot that Rians had already crossed. Jesus, what a reply a back, man. That's a nice shot. Made. Dude, I'm Heretics telling you, Boo's playing insane. On them. What a way to start off this round. Easy early picks. Meteor rotating and he's going to be the only player anywhere near. He landed for the shot though, right? Because <laughs> it looked really fast. Okay, shout out to Boo, man. Look at this guy, dude. He's playing so well. This was a massive round for Team Heretics to win as well. If they lose this one, you can see from the credits, you've got a couple of players who were quite low. And then the kills also even boosted them up slightly. Without that... They would be in trouble. Gen G would be 12 9, three chances to close it. Two it was jiggle rounds <coughs> when they're holding out oh, really the interesting. Next one, Heretics wouldn't have enough money to confidently buy on every player. Instead, it's 11, presumably to 10. As Texture's going to double blast pack, kill a bunch of people, and defuse in the next couple seconds. So, Gen G find themselves in the tough spot. Take a look at their credits. They're not sitting pretty at all. And Team Heretics are getting close to a couple of ultimates. Showstopper now just one away after Mini Boo's round. Yeah, and, and they're well going to go against Nico. The scales, if not back in Heretics favor, are looking at the money here. Even territory. Yeah, it seems like they're definitely getting further and further back into this one, even with a blip here and there. The problem is just like this in the last map. It looked like they were going to climb all the way, turn this game into a victory. And then just Absolute Genji, shot. it's almost like they realize it gets close and then they have something to play around. This time, yeah, it, it's a similar spot. Financially, it's not looking good. Uh, Genji shouldn't be winning yeah, this round. Yeah, all-wise. That's where it seems like Heretics... Far away from like, these. That's where it seems like they trip close up to and all give of these. on the other side an opportunity and well. Now let's all, let's be real. Yeah, the, the ecos haven't been great, the though. Texture, the ecos have been pretty close. Something done here for them. Yeah, you can't really put any pressure on other players. That said, the pistols have done a lot of damage in some of the previous rounds. Very, very slow approach from the attacking side towards C and B, but that's just one man left behind to cover that ground. Now, all they wanted was rubble control in the early round, and they found it pretty much uncontested. The rifle on mound won't get a chance to strike. In fact, it looks like it's going to be Karen and Lakia, a sheriff and a classic, that have to hold strong. shouldn't be too much of an issue for the side of heretics oh. utility being expended in fact they're even going to use the lockdown here and whoop and they're not taking waiting. any chances with this paranoia in hand oh. <laughs> poor munchkin man he ate the, the omen flash into, <laughs> into like the eating that are playing this one incredibly safe Don't that was so uncalled for any sneaky corners any risky spots that could cause them issues and now in the post plant this is going to become a lot tougher 
Yeah, it looks like most of the bodies are gonna go with the rifle. Woot's up top now, ready to fire back. The I like that from him. Give away the fact that a rifle on the other side. They like, create a lot of respect. pressure, then they fall back. Yeah, this was Benji nice. Fishy. And they kind of learned from Rapping earlier, where, you know that eco run where they let them take too much space and then they got caught just holding here Tension. and they lined up? It, it feels like they're learning from those <laughs> runs as well. Dude, what is that little one two as well? Um, this is scary for Gen G. There's some good ults here. In what is a very important round. They still have Fadal though, right? He's going to be pushing up to 12 and have map point under their belt. The ultimates. Uh, Shower Natty, thank you so much again for uh, an extra gifted. Appreciate you doing that. And Squelchy as well with the Prime. Welcome into the Star Club. Thanks for using your Prime on my dude. For the most part, after that first part, we have sort of been waiting for the moment. Tower again, thank you for doing that, dude. Round 20 looked like it might be, but no, it seems like Heretics are locking things down at the moment. Where yeah, you're see more the money is well if they lose this. Okay, 11-11, and if Gen G lose, they have to. Of some kind of low buy. Well, we've seen them go aggressive B a couple Ooh, of times. Oh, they call for the punish over towards C. In case they go towards mount. This is a, a scary go. prospect. This is what Genji need. Off Something the turret like contact. This big play. The trap though has been escaped. Heretics just about make it They're out. They're good to get out of there. Instant reaction from Wu is to take Wu space, behind, knowing that they heavy commit to well. this. Karen's watching it. It'll be a and then they raise now, all the back to mount. clear this. Then you kind of locked the into the site. This is nice from and it's Heretics. They're handling it well. Aaron 4 HP. Of the and with the orb down, they're not going to be decayed walking through. Karen needs to be sublime. And did great. Only one to be found. It's worth it. Trading out his low health. In goes the Nightfall. Meteor and Lakia up close. They you else did good. Woot did really good here. They look the other way. Woot rounds the corner and takes a kill. I, 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 nice that reaction from Heretics. Definitely the done some good prep into this one. Keep this 12th round out of Heretics' hands, and it, I, I'm not even thinking that he's going for it at this stage. He's so far away and all alone against three. Still a Viper's pit for Heretics, though, and that's a scary prospect for a 12 to 11 scoreline. Well, yeah, this is now where you have to think. Okay, the, the heretics, they're great in OTs. So they're looking to try and close out that, uh, map in a similar fashion to the last. And work out their money. 2-9 on top of all of I, this. I this guy gets this one, so we can't really a, drop. Pretty much a death um, sentence for them, this was really cool, though, from Genji. Uh, sorry, from, from Heretics. So they've definitely looked at this before storm, where they have the turret. Like as soon as they saw the turret, they realized what play it was. Boomed, even with they managed to get out of here. Slip away. Woot did so good. Instant all over towards here. Then he didn't overstep. He was just, just waiting for the reaction. Then he smokes up waterfall. They time. raise ult to clear back this. Even with some aggressive Dude just got his gun out the whole time. Moves coming out from Gen G with a, a decent trap um, setup. And, yeah, and they used to fade react. And I love the TP coming out of Wu. You can see it immediately put the opposition in doubt of where he could have gone, where he was positioned. Did he just serve on the minimap? that round so much more difficult. Yeah, otherwise the three That's players on B probably go sprinting through the spawn and they'll be there to support Karen or at least to trade him out afterwards. Instead, they have to be so cautious about just how deep he could be. 12 rounds for Team Heretics. They struggled on the last map, always on the heels of Gen.G, but not able to take the lead out of their hands. And now, while well, the shoe's on the other foot, Heretics just won away from guaranteeing themselves a bind and what could be a very competitive close to this series, to this rematch. Not a bit of deja vu from the 1-0 for Gen.G and the fight back from Heretics. Yeah, they've won seven of the last eight. And then the one that was won by Gen G used a lot of ultimates to put them into that position. Right the game, now, oh, it's been online. a stacked a game, yeah. But both maps have been really good. An incredible start to this map. He's still doing well, but has definitely stopped having those high impact rounds that we've seen from him. And the wait will be to see if this is the moment where somebody on the Gen G side steps up to the point if they have the best tour of the game so far I, I think both of the heretics games a, a like idea, in the, the most fun to watch at the moment off of it when it was put into play and you can see the credits are, are double just attack up. Are three triple attack up. waiting they're spending all of their extra credits yeah we got, just to try and got extra money pick. got backup guns that is a pretty nasty idea season 8 but that gets Karen into position the spams <laughs> Who goes down Who's more than anyone else here? Being followed up on. And for Heretics, an immediate stoppage to the play. One of those ops has already been traded out. And I think soon we'll see the same thing happen. But the idea here again is they're making noise on A. They're spamming away. And hopefully 
on B or C, someone oh. gets curious. But as we can see, that ain't happening. Gen G have lost a lot of HP on Lackey though, thanks to the Ode. They have both. They go back for their reclip, but tagged, and uh, there is okay. the go. That's the exact well, that'll they do it. For. They're going to have a decent idea as is well. He, I'm pretty sure Karen he pinged before he did it. Aaron, Snake is bite. he sticking around? Oh, he's sticking around. Not going to be forcing him off this oh, he's paranoia. in trouble. The world. They're already looking to try and just execute onto him. That was Ryan's man. That was it. Uh, I feel but like that still, kill on texture is everything there. The way of Two stand in their way. 2v4 to cure it. On a map that was heavily favored. Munchkin has a molly. To the reigning Masters champions, looking to try and take this to a third, but there's still a couple to deal with. Meteor's had a lot of big rounds, and Munchkin, when he needs to, he can step up to the plate, and he certainly does need to this time. Spike Two players it. just around the corner, and he misses them by a hair. Wrapping back around, they're ready and swinging straight into him. Well, Meteor has that's the a gun. First and knows where the other two are. The swing is good. He spotted them and heard the shrouded step. Heard the second two. They've split the angle. Perhaps offered Meteor a chance to isolate the fight. And he connects the shot. Oh, Locked no. Down, now in play. And it's Benji Fishy needing the clutch to keep okay, the Okay, shout out to Benji. All right, so we, we get a 13, uh, we have 13, 11, 13, 11, and the only reason that we didn't get overtime is because both teams got 2 0 for pistols. And now Bind will be the final battle. Did we get a Bind? Yeah, That's sick. But dude, a, what a map this was as well. Come back from that position they were in. It looked like they were down and out. But somehow, this team once again. Yeah, has that's, uh, man, shout out to everyone. Dude, everyone's playing so well. It's sick to watch.